What's up? Howdy. Howdy. We back. Or I'm back. We're both back. We're both back. And we're here with March of the Machines. Number two? Um, this is number six. The last box. Number six box. Okay. So, so I did the first one. Yep. Yeah, so I'm going to do the last one. I couldn't find... Um, I just grabbed the closest thing. <laughs> that is... Uh quite interesting it's, it's sharp well it's supposed to be sharp uh, I it, have no idea what that thing's supposed to be like a back scratch yeah telescoping okay. okay nope not that sharp I mean it, I guess it shouldn't be that sharp or else it's gonna like just destroy your back it almost looks like a torture tool or something uh, it's a there you go I, it, no return. it looks sharp but it's not that sharp. But like I said, it would make sense, right? If you had like this sharp ass ba back scratcher. Unless you're into that, you know? That kind of thing. I don't think it's so. Po it's possible. Alright, so we got. Um, Alright. Let's see if we still remember how to do this. Uh, you should do a video how to open the booster pack. Yeah. Alright, booster pack looking good. No box toppers, and nope. oh my god, what the? F it's really, it's really hard to open, dude. I need to build up my um, thumb strength or something. All right. Yeah, be careful. Why? So you don't bend the card for you open. They're pre-bent. All right. So do we know the order? That's a good point. Okay, so what do, I don't even know what I'm, wh how to organize these. This set was, uh, I don't know, it felt a little confusing. Lore Master. Okay. So we got C Double, Arax, Slumber Isle. Alright. I don't even know what I'm looking at. Okay, so whatever. I'm trying to get the. Uh, what am I trying? The top rare, which is worth something, is mm -hmm. the Fairy Mastermind. That's what you want to look for. Fairy Mastermind. I just got to figure out how I am going to organize this. So this, this, Knight's Sli Cider, Dina, Soul Steeper. That's a kind of a cool looking one. Then we have, uh, again, Dina Soul Streeper, Steepa. Croax, Death of... that. Might, I think that should be good. Cro Croxon, isn't that one of a... Uh, Croxus? Yeah, Croxus Titan of Death's Hunger. Wasn't he like the top card of whatever? Yeah, a while back. Croxus, Of Death's Hunger. Titan of Death's Hunger. Oh my gosh, dude, what the... Okay, there we go. I think going from the back actually is better. All right, we got okay. Ever German swamp swamp. Okay, so you don't always get one of those big car. Oh no, you get double land or something. What the heck? Oh, sometimes, sometimes. Double land, Rowan's talent, rampaging. Then we got this timerat, choose from death. This I don't know what that is. Yeah. Summerfall. Whoa, that's a cool looking card. Oh. Grayuda, doom of deaths. I'm gonna put that somewhere. Obviously. There's a lot of uh, cool foiling in the set. Like. Well, they. It's pretty much um. What what is? Sunfall $2. What is Sunfall? Uh, what is that? One of the cards you pulled. Oh. Alright, so we got this two sided card, whatever. Swamp. C double again. Omnath, Locus of All. Nice. Omnath is now a rare. Fae of the Fang. 
Fang Bearer, Blood <laughs> Feather, Blood Feather Phoenix. Oh, and uh, the Brudiglad. Brudic Brudic Clad. Okay. I think I got one of those. I think the the. Okay, never mind. I think opening it from the bottom helps. I'll try that out. Okay. Tribute to the World Tree. World Tree. Okay. Oh, another one of those foilies. Oh! They got the old school, um, whatever that is. Tribute to the World Tree is one of the kind of top cards. Okay. Is that a foil one? Judith, the Scourge Diva. Uh, this is a regular foil tribute. That might be your top card there. Oh, yeah? How much is that? Eight dollars. Eight dollars? All right, and I got one of those old yeah. school um, Amon Cat thingies. Yeah, there's gonna be all sorts of different borders. The foiling is actually pretty cool on that. Yeah. Oh, we got the Heliod. Heliod. And then we got a bar, but a little bit of flip. Scheming Thief, Igna, Runeyes, Rona, Sidar. Jabar is this is a, a mythic. Rona is like a dollar. Oh, that's a cool foiling. Kintry Spirit. This is a cool foil. This is like a black and white foil. Yeah. Like you said. I like that. It's number one. Zero 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 oh no, D one or something. I don't know what the hell that is. Oh. You scared me. I thought you got serious. Nah. I was reading. Okay. We got do you like halfway through already? Yep. For real. We're not we're not looking for value here. We're looking for the big daddies. For cards. Okay. Then Yargol. Then we got Deep Root, Wayfinder, Essence. Then we got the don't know what this is. Zero zero, huh? Instantly dead. Uh, Polychron, Reborn, Fire, Storm, Sun, Speak, Seeker. Nothing good there. But I'm guessing that's like... I'm still like confused that... I, I don't think I put all the Mythics there. I'll have to go back and look, but... So we got the Archpriest of Shadows, City on Fire. Vulpin, Harvester... Call to the hunt. Raf, pile on. And I first whatever. City on fire goes up. City on fire. That's cool. All right, we got that swamp. Maybe you got ten bucks in value. <laughs> Good. Drana. Alliance, Rona again. Rona again. Fijar, Judge of Valor. This one is oh, there's a mythic here. It's a uh, Zamone and Dina, and then another mythic, Aurelia the War Leader. Let's see, Aurelia, Zamone and Dina is like uh, that foil is like five bucks. Five bucks. Oh my. Whoops. Damage that token. Okay, we got that, that, and then we got the fairy mastermind. It's a uh, Elish Norn. There we go. Is that good? There go. I don't know that. That's black a showcase, black and white. To Fury's talent. Non foil, right? Yeah, non foil, black and white. So about seventeen bucks. Dang, Igna and Eska, and. Tegma Wijita Master. Oh, Elish Norn is that like the the that conehead person? It's a flip card. You gotta put it over. Oh, it's a flip card. Oh, whoops! Just hit the gimbal. Excuse me. 
Keep oh. it over. All right. Okay. It's a... What's that called? Uh, what's that called? <laughs> what What is that called? It's, uh, the legend? No, it's not legend. Saga, right? Yeah, it's Saga. I think it's called Saga. Glistening Dawn. Wildfire Awakener. Zada. Fija. Fuja. Vivian Talent. Captain. Whoa, that's a cool looking one. Captain. Wow, I like the foiling on that. Captain. It's like, it's like 3D. Yeah. Interesting card. Legendary the creature. Art? The art for that. Alright, last pack. Drana. Drana and Nirvana. Hey, there's Galta, the Mavern. Alright, let's see. I have to go through some of these. I think I maybe the Chrome Host Seed Shark. Phyrexian the Shark. The Phyrexian Shark. Yeah. Conclave Sledge Captain. Okay, so we got like the Ether Revolt type Rava Master Smith. Igna Runize, Ancient Impersaurus, and then we got the Thalia, Guardian of Thrabin. Thalia. Is that getting. So you get one of each, maybe, like, of those, um. What are those called? Like, um. Amonkhet type. Yeah, there's like a lot of different sets in there. Oh, there's so this like is the car. That's a myth thing. Tribute to the world tree you said is worth something. About the Thor hammer, the constellation foil, the edge foil, legendary creatures. There's like a little bit of everything in there. Listening dawn, wildfire awakener. Vivian's talent, Tefiri's talent. Is Tefiri's talent worth anything? It has Tefiri in it. Uh. Croxa Titan of Hunger. Of Death Hunger, right? Yeah. Croxa. Titan of Hunger. Omrath should be worth something, come on. Phyrexian Element. Rowan's talent, rampaging raptor, sunfall. A lot of the value is in there's a section called multiverse legends, where they like uh, reprinted Ragavan. Mm-hmm. Probably gonna be the top part. Hey, look, movie. deluxe dragster from uh, New Capenna. C double slumbering. So nothing I really missed. So yeah, I don't think I got that much Captain Ouija uh, first of all. They got the Texas in there again. Aurelia the war leader. How about this Digeru 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 the Hazard something. Judith the the Scorned Diva. Judith, Doom right. of the Depths. This is a cool foil. It's like, um, what's it called? Uh, etched. This last section has to be the one where, um, the hot section. Yeah, Kin Tree Spirit. It has all like the, the cool foiling, the black and whites. Yeah, there's different, like there's like new Capenna foiling, there's black and white, there's... Why did I put this weird card up there? There you go. The War Leader, Zita. There's like... Croxian. Yeah, the Croc... The Croxian. Yes. Uh, stained glass. Stained glass foiling, you know, all that. Crazy. They put everything in there. And then the, the Korea kind of kind of thing. Yeah, they're all in there. Or the Thalia. Okay. 
All the R work. Mm -hmm. right you got the consolation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, some of this foiling is pretty cool. Yeah, the set looks really good overall. My lands are starting to foil though, not surprising. What do you mean, curl? curl? Yeah, since since the last opening, yeah. it's already starting to curl a little bit. Mm. Feels like a little more than usual. Hmm, I'll have to see. So far, they came out pretty straight. Yeah, they came out straight. Uh huh. Mine might look good when we opened it, but mm. just sitting out there. I'll take a picture. I'll send it to you. All right. Yep, so anyways, the value of this box probably is bad. So we're not even going to look at it. We're not even going to yeah. tally that up. This is just, this initial opening is just to get the, get the feet wet again. Mm-hmm, yeah. And then, uh, we're um, trying to get back into, we still have the, uh, Rex, yeah. Yep. So, anyways, hope you guys are enjoying this new set. This is actually my first experience with it. I haven't opened any draft or set yet, so I might open some just to take a look. Overall, uh, initial impression is I'm kind of confused at <laughs> what I'm looking at. There's but so much going on. There's a lot, of, yeah, but um, I will say the foiling on these cards like especially look at like this one um it's is cool um the full art cards are cool and i like the um, the the border of you know like the old school um inventions and stuff that's kind of cool too so um overall so far so good now value wise sucks so that that hasn't changed very bad um but i think because of the potential of a serial card it has kept the value of this set up yeah a lot of the serial cards are good yeah that's cool i think Did it probably when you get chases like that it seems like it's uh crushes everything else yeah but it keeps the value of it higher, so... Yeah, yeah. Let me see, how's the seal price right now for this? Just for I think it's still at like 210 220 That's pretty good. I think on Amazon it still had it for that price. If it, if it can maintain the 200 weeks That's after the initial release, it should be pretty good. Because I think even like Dominaria... Uh, Phyrexia, this set are still in the 200s. Yeah, this is uh, pretty good actually. 220 I'm seeing. Yeah, TCG. okay. That's, that's very good actually. When you get those chase cards, it, it helps keep the value up. Yeah. Whereas like yeah. all the other sets have cratered. It's kind of like uh, having, uh, what do we call those, masterpiece type cards in there, mm -hmm. kind of. Yeah. Okay. It makes it special, but the value of it is so bad. It's like, yeah. It's like if you're opening up uh, Kaladesh, too. Yeah. If you want value in the regular cards, huh? Yeah, it's actually like opening up, like, our Devastation. <laughs> <laughs> you get a box for, like, cheap, but you're just hunting for that, like, one in one case. Thing. Yeah, you're trying to get that, that card, yeah. Yeah. So over, but yeah, um, I think they did a good job on the foiling. Um, or at least the art is different. You know, they didn't reuse the art on some of it. They probably reused the art on some other stuff too. But like this, um, the like this Croxia Titan is different art. That's the only one I do, and I think um, um, what's that? They had a. Uh, What's this called? The Judith yeah. card is different. So, different picture is cool. Yeah, that Judith is uh, reprinted. I think that's one of the better cards in there. Isn't this from, like, Crimson? 
Oh no no, it's not from Crimson. It's from. Was it War of the Spark? Is it War of the Spark? Or is it like from Ixal? No, not Ixalan. What's that? It starts with the R. I think. Let me see. I'm uh, looking it up right now. Oh. Ravnica. Ravnica. There we go. I did it say start Ravnica. with the R. Yeah. Yeah. So. Cool. This is a cool art, the original one. Yeah. So, overall good. We're gonna open some more, and then hopefully we'll get better value. Uh, <laughs> Thanks for watching, and keep on cracking. Keep on cracking.